I'm Aaron. And I'm Ava, and we're just a couple of back to the and this is Botany, Botany for kids. kids. And this is a special Halloween episode. And we're celebrating. We're also celebrating his birthday. Yeah, Halloween is also if you, my if birthday. If you don't celebrate Halloween, so. Celebrate my birthday. Yes. So, today we thought we'd do something special and feature a super dangerous plant family that has a lot of super poisonous members in the plant it's family. Mostly, it's not only deadly, but I mean, we eat some of them. Yes, yeah, some of them are not deadly, but many of them are. And what's the name of the family called? Deadly Nightshades. The Deadly Nightshades. And so we want to show you what some Deadly Nightshade members look like. And we've got one right here that we picked off the side of the I'm road. Gonna, I'm gonna pick it up. You're gonna pick it up? Gonna We're gonna wear some gloves, of course, it because up? it's super poisonous. And so it has yeah, it also has them. it also has thorns on it, so you don't want to touch these even if you're invincible. And now what's the what's the name of that flower, do you remember? Carolina something. Carolina horse nettle. Horse nettle. Yeah. yeah, and it's in the deadly nightshade family or the Solanaceae. And it has five petals. Yeah, very good. So it, it has, has six stamens too. Five two. petals, five stamens. Show them a little closer on that flower. It also has five sepals. Is probably what you're thinking of. And we'll get a we'll get a clearer version of that here in a minute. Yeah, how many thorns on this? Even now we also have some of the fruits. Which, if you look up. Uh, no, get it with you. There you go. If you look nice. up, if you look closely at these, kind of look like little baby what? Tomatoes. And right. They don't look like berries, but, but they're called scientists like him call them berries. <laughs> so in botany, we call a fruit that looks like this. Show them berries. And so this is the fruit of the Carolina horse nettle as well. All right. Yeah, this is totally my hand. And so in the <laughs> she she stole my giant glove. <laughs> And so the, the, left hand. the, the flower in the deadly nightshade family looks like a star and the fruit looks like a berry. So let's take a closer look. All right. Okay. So let's take a closer look like we always do at the flowers of the deadly nightshade family or the Solanaceae. So we've already said that they have five petals. But you can see here that those five petals are all connected together or united. You can also see that they have five stamens and they're long shaped like a tube. In fact, sometimes the whole flower in the nightshade family will be a long tube shaped flower with five united petals. You can also see that little green thing sticking out of the top. And that's the tip of the stigma. We also mentioned that the fruits of the nightshade are oftentimes berries. And these things that look like little baby tomatoes are called berries in botany. Now that was just a kid who wasn't in there. I have one more thing to say about, about that that's a nightshade and it relates to the berries and it's about and it's about potatoes tomatoes and peppers all in there just just like we said in the beginning of the video we can eat these things we can eat some members of the deadly nightshade family like potatoes and tomatoes and peppers but many <laughs> of them are super poisonous sorry evie's been sick for the last week or so but we wanted to <laughs> <laughs> we wanted to make sure, she wanted to make sure, and get this episode done because it's Halloween tomorrow. And so we're running <laughs> out of, birthday. and my birthday. And so we're running out of time. Um, so one last time. Deadly Nightshade members have five, 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 five. five petals, five stamens, one five little stigma sepals. sticking out of the end, and five sepals at the end there. Five petals. And so the whole point of this scary episode is to make sure and never eat a plant you're not sure of, right? And usually don't even touch a plant you're not sure of. But without very much a lot of protection and adult supervision. Adult supervision, so. right? Make sure most of the things at the grocery store are usually safe, right? But outside, you're not really sh if you're not really sure if the plant you're you're touching is safe, then don't touch it. And let alone, definitely don't eat it.
All right. What? <laughs> this smells you. <laughs> You're mocking me? Yeah. As always, I'm Aaron. And I'm Evie, and we're just a couple of lucky and this is Botany me. for Kids. I said that at the studio boy. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.